Hey everyone, it's Minjay Cho and today I've got Scott who I've been working for a few months now and Scott is someone who was struggling to get rid of his porn addiction for quite a while and today he's past the 70 day mark of being porn free since we started working together. So first off, I'd like to congratulate you Scott for this accomplishment and he's achieved a lot in his life. Uh, through this whole period of working together. So today we're going to be going into some details of his journey and how it all happened. So once again, Scott, uh, what's going on? Thank you for doing this for me, man. Well, thank you for everything that you've done. I mean, I couldn't have done any of this without you. I was, I was struggling with it for a long time. I was trying a bunch of different things. I couldn't, I couldn't make it past a, just a couple of days. And, uh, with your help, I've been able to get this out of my life. That is amazing. So let's start off with like a little background of uh, your situation and uh, just a little bit about who you are, man. <clears throat> I was, I probably figured out that I was struggling with porn addiction probably maybe like a year and a half before I met you um just when I kind of came across some videos about porn addiction and I kind of it sounded a lot similar to my situation um and I was just trying all kinds of the the basic strategies to try and overcome it but I could never get past just a couple of days the longest I got was probably 10 days in that time span and after about a year and a half that's when I came across your page on TikTok and I decided to check it out and um you know that's everything changed right there got it and and yeah like let's dive into a little bit about yeah you, the year and a half you were kind of struggling what was kind of the the main issues that that you were kind of going through well, I, I noticed that um, I kind of had like a lot of social anxiety, just um, when I'd, uh, you know, watch porn or anything, I'd go out and uh, in a social interaction, I just felt really uncomfortable and awkward. And it's just hard to, uh, you know, just look someone right in the eye. And um a lot it was a, a lack of self-confidence in myself got it yeah I, I, I went through word by word I went through the exact same thing um, when it came to my journey as well and what was the main problem that you wanted to solve in terms of getting over this porn addiction the uh well I know it was just a uh, waste of time and a waste of energy. You, there's so much more stuff that you can get done um, with this time and energy that you're wasting uh, just watching porn and just, and also getting rid of it. Um, I was hoping to gain more confidence in myself and more be able to just interact freely in a social environment. Got it. And yeah, you mentioned a little bit about, you know, a year and a half, you've tried everything. Yeah, let's, uh, let's talk about, yeah, what did you try before we started working together? <clears throat> it was kind of like just when a uh, urge popped up, you uh, just try some quick exercises. There's a um, I tried just like praying and uh, reading the Bible and uh, um, like hopping in the shower and just hopefully just that would get rid of the urge. But, you know, that it works for a little bit. Each different strategy works for a little bit, but um, it, none of it would work long term. Got it. 
Yeah, yeah. Like we always talked about, right? Like we call those the the surface area techniques. Yeah. Yeah. Um, very common um, for sure. And uh, did you have any hesitations or fears about working together? Oh, I mean, yeah, because it's a uh, it's a pretty uncomfortable and embarrassing subject to open yourself up to someone else about. So it was a little uh, a little scary to go to someone else and ask for help. Um, but uh, I went with it, and I don't have any regrets for it. I'm so glad, man. And what kind of specific things did you like about us working together? <clears throat> um, well, my, I think my biggest thing was just the, the daily texts that we did every night. Um, I just text you how the day went, um, uh, urges that may have come up and if I did, then we would go over it in detail, what happened and uh, how to overcome it in that specific situation. We come up with a uh, kind of like an exit strategy to get out of that situation, come up with a plan. And um, each time, if, uh, if something works, you kind of, we just kept going back to it and we're, we figured out a specific um, plan that would finally work. Got it. I appreciate it, man. And um, yeah, I know I mentioned at the beginning, but what day, I know you're not trying to keep count of it, but what day are you currently on? Um, uh, like since uh, you've been porn free, what day are we at? Yeah, how many days? Yeah. Um... I know after a while, I kind of stopped keeping count of the specific day, but I, it's somewhere around the 70 day mark. I think maybe a little past that. Amazing. And what kind of things have you accomplished and what kind of things have changed in your life since we've started working together and you've been able to, uh, to, to get rid of this and out of your mind? Well, you definitely feel uh, a shift in your your mood, um, you know, because when I was constantly using porn, I, it's a constant uh, feel of disgust in yourself and uh, depression, and you just feel a uh, overall um, positive feeling. You feel more energetic. You can get more stuff done. Um, feel more confident in myself and uh since i started working with you i i um received a promotion at work and now there's talks of um me getting another uh another promotion pretty soon i mean that's yeah amazing to hear man um i'm so happy for you and you deserve it all you deserve it all uh anything else How's your, how's your overall mood, your energy, you know, your confidence? <clears throat> um, yeah, tell us about that. Just uh, like when I was, when I was using porn, it, it's just, it, it felt like a, a constant roller coaster of, I maybe build up like a two, three day streak. I think the longest I built up was like 10 days um, and you start feeling a little good about yourself and then you just go back and relapse and then you're just right back to the, the feelings of just being disgusted with yourself and you're just like, what the hell is wrong with me? Why can't I do this? And uh, after just being free of this for such a long time now, it's you're not dealing with those constant negative feelings in yourself. Um, so it's uh, overall, you're just more positive, 
more happy just the whole time. Um, and you just, you know, you feel more confident in yourself knowing that this habit isn't just holding you back anymore. Amazing. And you're 21 years old now, right? That's right. It's amazing, man. It's amazing for getting over this at, at your age. Like your, your life is going to be, it already is, but like just kudos to you for getting rid of it at this age. Um, that's good for you, man. Um, and uh, if uh, last question, if you were to recommend this um, to, to your best friend or another person, um, you know, maybe one of my followers or anybody who sees my, uh, like my, my content, uh, who's looking to quit and uh, is looking to maybe work together, what would you tell them? I mean, I would tell them to do it. It's, uh, I know it's really scary to come out to someone else and tell them all about this because it is a really personal, embarrassing habit to have but uh i i felt the same way i was real hesitant and nervous to do it but i went with it and you uh i mean you work with you worked with me real closely um and uh we came up with specific plans that that worked for me specifically and uh it without it like like i said before i could only go a couple days without going back and watching porn and after working with you i'm now 70 days without it so it is 100 percent worth it well scott thank you so much once again um for your time i i've enjoyed working with you since day one, man. And thank you for committing and putting in the effort to, to getting over this. And, and yeah, man, um, thank you so much for coming on this call. Uh, any, any last words um, that you would like to share uh, with anyone? I'd say um, this experience has been, it's been life-changing and just, I completely, I went, I had a complete 180 of where I felt my life was going. Um, I didn't, I had like no confidence in myself and I just didn't see myself really going anywhere. And this program with you, it's just, um, you know, I've got, a plan for my future and uh now i can clearly see where i want to go from here scott thank you so much man